four, three fish and three casts and missed one just then. Hi, this is Bill Watts, the host of SurfRatsBall.com. And this is a night where me and my charter, we were on to nice blues and nice bass. And there he goes, he's on to a fish. Nice. And the, the bass and the blues, they were on uh, juvenile wheat fish and snappers. Perfect imitation of that are uh, daughters. I love Super Strike daughters. I use them 99% of the time. And this particular night, we were, I think we were primarily using yellow because they were juvenile wheat fish. What I want you to notice is the techniques. Look at how he's reeling right now. He's putting his rod down, gaining on the fish, and then pulling back. Pulling back, gain on the fish. Pull back. Now watch his reel. He's going to reel, gain on the fish. Always keep in tension. He's not pulling, he's not putting his rod down hard. He's putting it down nice and soft. See, always with tension on the fish. And at the beginning of the video, I want you to notice where the rod is. The rod is locked between his legs. His hand is open. Lock the, locking the rod in between the legs enables him to feel the tip of the rod more. Notice his retrieve. His retrieve was a moderate retrieve. I would consider that moderate speed. The reason why we're going a little bit faster than dead slow that night is because of the current. You have to adapt to the uh, conditions. Um, the conditions will tell you uh, what retrieve speed um, to retrieve. Another thing is, notice his hand. His hand was open. His rod was resting on his fingertips, which is a great technique, is what I teach He's my charters all the time. Oh. Nice the open hand allows nice you to give fiber. more feel oh, to yeah. a plug than a closed hand. Dude. And there's the fish. <laughs> nice fish. <laughs> I want to weigh this one, huh? Striper, Lee. Big one. I think we can pop this hook out with no sweat. Oh, that's a nice fish, man. Let me see. 